What's up everyone? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Jess. I am heading on a long European trip soon. So I thought I would film a little pack and prep with me. I've seen a couple of these videos on YouTube and I love these. I think they're so helpful and I just find it interesting to see what everyone packs. So we're gonna do Paris, the Amalfi Coast of Italy. And then we're spending about a week in Santorini. So excited. I haven't been to any of these places except for Paris. So I'm gonna be packing a lot of summer clothes. I'm gonna be getting my nails done tomorrow. I usually just paint them myself but since this trip is over two weeks i just wanted to ensure that my nails weren't going to chip a couple days into the trip i'm going to get a classic gel manicure i'm only going with a carry-on and a personal item as a personal item, I'm bringing this mini backpack. I'm also just going to use this as my everyday bag while I'm there. It has a little pocket in the front here with some pouches. And then it has a few pouches on the inside as well as a little zippered pouch here for the main carry-on bag. This is the Away black carry-on suitcase. It has a little lock on it, a luggage tag. It also includes this little pouch on the inside of the bag that has what looks like a dirty laundry bag or you could probably you know use it for whatever you want but i would probably put some dirty laundry in this throughout the trip hopefully everything fits I'm gonna be packing all my toiletry slash makeup items now. This is just everything laid out. I have makeup here. I have stuff for the shower, shampoo, conditioner, and face wash, toothbrush, and a little toothpick thing. Q-tips, a razor, soap bars here, because we're gonna be in a few different destinations. So these are really small. We'll have one for each place we're staying at, basically. A mini deodorant and some tweezers, a mini toothpaste, and this is just all my skincare stuff. Moisturizer, facial scrub, makeup remover, over, acne treatment, serums, and some sunscreens for the face and body. I'm gonna bring some tissues just in case, and then I have a little box here that just has some band-aids and medicine, things like that, just in case. And then just some makeup brushes and a lip gloss, a boob, like nipple stickers. These are gonna come in handy for certain outfits I have. Our trip is about 16 days but it's really like 15 full days of sightseeing and then the day of traveling back home so i want to pack 15 different outfits and then one or two airport outfits halfway through our trip we're staying at an airbnb which gives us access to laundry so i don't need to bring a pair of underwear and socks technically for every single day i'm probably only going to bring like eight pairs so i'm just gonna start going through my closet and picking out some stuff to put together 15 different outfits I just started laying everything out. I'm actually waiting for one more piece to come from Poshmark, which is a dress. It's supposed to come either later today or tomorrow. I'm only going to be bringing two pairs of shoes. I'm just gonna have a pair of sneakers. These are a pair of New Balances that I recently got. And then these are Dr. Scholl's sandals. I also recently got these at Famous Footwear. They're just a really comfortable shoe. I'm gonna try all the outfits on now that I kind of laid out on the bed. Take pictures of me in the outfits, just so I have some ideas to when I'm on the trip. I can take a look at my pictures and decide which outfit I want to wear that day.
the last thing I was waiting for just came in the mail. It's just a Realization Par dress. I've never tried anything from that brand. So it's pretty expensive, but I found a dress on Poshmark. So I'm gonna try it on and I really hope it fits. Thank God it fits and it literally fits perfectly. I'm so happy with this. Looks like it adjusts here as well. Cute, funky, kind of retro floral print. It's just a mixture of like summer and fall in a dress. Very happy with this. I have a pair of sneakers. This is what I'm also gonna be wearing on the plane. A pair of sandals, four bathing suits. I have a skort, three pairs of shorts, one denim, two like comfy. I'm bringing one cropped sweater. I have three dresses, some socks, underwear, and a pair of pajamas. I'm bringing a pair of jeans just in case it can get cooler at night and it might be a little cooler in Paris. I'm bringing 12 tops in total, including the one sweater here. So this is everything I need to bring in my suitcase or wear to the airport. Usually for the airport, I like to wear the bulkier items I'm bringing. So I'm just gonna have a pair of leggings because I usually get cold on planes. Uh, since we have a couple flights, I'm bringing two of these cropped tees from Aritzia. Um, one of them I'm gonna pack and then one I'll wear. I'm bringing a cardigan as well, so I'm gonna wear that. So my airport outfit's gonna be this right here. Also gonna pack a strapless bra because I'm gonna use that for a couple of my outfits. And I'm gonna bring a rain jacket because unfortunately right now they're showing a chance of rain in Paris. Hopefully that doesn't become an issue, but I'm gonna bring a raincoat just in case. So now I'm just gonna take all this clothes here except for the airport outfit and I'm just gonna fit them ideally into two small space bags. I ordered a six pack of these high bag small flat space bags on Amazon. These look like a pretty good size and they're supposed to fit like a carry-on suitcase pretty well. I usually like to put my bathing suits in these little 437 bags. So I think I'm just gonna do two per bag. Some items that I have that are just a little nicer, like the Jerf Avenue dress. I like to put into like a little separate bag just so nothing accidentally snags anything. I'll put the Realization Par dress in this bag as well. And just my Jerf Avenue tube top. So I'm back from the nail salon now, but now I'm at my boyfriend's house and I brought everything with me. I'm gonna pack all my stuff in the suitcase. I'm gonna put all my clothes in the space compression bag. I need to stay within, I believe like a 22 pound weight limit. bring the pump with us but he might put this in his suitcase because I think he might have a little more room than me. I'm just gonna try to put as much in here. These are my hair ties, hair clips, and a headband. I'm just gonna pack my personal bag so I think I'm just gonna throw my raincoat maybe in the personal bag. I'm also just gonna bring a sleeping mask in my personal item. And I always like to make sure I have a reusable water bottle. I feel like these just come in handy and this one's thermal so it stays cold. So I think that is everything. This is what the backpack looks like on. It's pretty comfortable and it fits a really good amount. So happy with this 
your Bradley small backpack. And then I just have my carry-on bag. I'm very happy that everything was able to fit between both of my bags. And I feel like those space compression bags make such a big difference. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed and found this video helpful. The next videos that you're going to see after this are going to be the Europe vlogs themselves. So make sure you guys subscribe and stay tuned for those. I'm going to Paris, the Amalfi Coast, and Greece. Thanks so much for watching, and I hope to see you all in the next video. Thank you.